one of the reasons I love Pimsleur is because you can take it with you on the road. Uh, in the United States, we spend inordinate amounts of times in our cars, going places, going to work, going to the store, doing this, doing that, taking the kids here, taking the kids there. We're always in the car. You can turn your car into a language learning university. So if your work was 15 minutes away, you could spend the morning drive doing your language learning, doing your Pimsleur or your Michelle Thomas. And then on the way home, you could listen to music or just roll down the windows and not worry about it. Uh, or you could do you know, 15 minutes one way and then 15 minutes the other way or seven minutes in the morning on your way to work and then, and then turn it off after seven minutes and put on a song to relax. And, and then when you drive home, you know, just for you know, seven minutes, listen to uh, Pimsleur and then you know, turn it off and roll down the windows and enjoy the, the quiet. If you just did 15 minutes a day, you would get through a 30-minute Pimsleur lesson every two days. Now, I, I usually redo my Pimsleur lessons a couple times to make sure I really got it down. But that time would add up. Seven minutes here, eight minutes there, ten minutes there, three minutes there. This would really add up. And it might take a month or two months or three months to get through a Pimsleur course. But then you, you've done it. And if you just, even if it took a whole spring to get through a Pimsleur course, in one year, if you did one a season, you get through four of them. You would get that. Your morning car ride could be your language learning studio. And in a year or a year and a half, you could go from not knowing anything in the language to being pretty good, you know, pretty good in spoken language in that uh, uh, in your target language. You could make serious prog progress if you got through all five levels of Pimsleur. So something that's normally a waste of time, which is driving from one place to another this huge amount of time that we spend in the car, you can really harness it. And that's one of the great things about Pimsleur or Michelle Thomas, is you can just, in my case, I like to put the CD, put the CD in, but you can bring your download with you on your phone, plug it into your car. You can turn your car into a language learning studio. And realistically, if you have kids or you're really busy with work, or you have kids and you're really busy with work at the same time, the car may actually be the best place to do this. It may be that the car is the only place where you really sort of have time during your day to yourself. And the car may actually become your best place to do language learning. Thanks so much for watching. Happy language learning. Uh, turn that morning commute into a language learning studio.